Hello everyone. On this uh, video here, this was my grade school when I was a young squirt <coughs> back in the 50s. Every Saturday they hold a indoor flea market year round. And uh, I only live a couple miles from the school right now. And um, well, let's go inside and take a look. It's, today was a very disappointing day because there wasn't very much at all. I've gotten some goodies there in the past. I've gotten some uh, tools and so forth and uh, good working VCRs and so on. But today, slim pickings. There isn't very much. These are the very corridors I used to walk down, uh, up and down when I was a kid. And the same bathrooms and everything are still there. Even the same urinals are still there. Um, this is my favorite section right over here where the tools are, but there was a guy standing right where I wanted to go, and he had a pile of stuff sitting in front. So I had to wander around the rest of the place here until I could get back there again, but there wasn't very much, like I say, very slim pickings. But most of the stuff that's in here is knickknacks and, and stuff like that, and there was a lot of women in there today, and being that it's very cold, it's only like about 15 degrees out today, uh, this is the only show in town, so to speak. Um, in the summertime, we, I usually go to yard sales, but uh, the last few years, even yard sales around our area are slim pickings. So, uh, I'm primarily interested in tools and old electronics and so forth. But I've gotten some, some good deals in this place throughout the years, and they've had this uh, flea market thing here for quite a number of years. And uh, it's one of my, it's my Saturday routine. They open the doors usually about 8.30, 9 o'clock in the morning. So after I have my breakfast, on Saturday mornings I go out and get my coffee and my uh, eggs and home fries and toast and so forth. Only on Saturdays I do that. The rest of the week I just get the coffee and uh, something small. And then after that I'll go here and then I'll continue on. And if it's in the summertime I'll be wandering around and trying to find some yard sales. Not that I need to pick up more junk for the house, but you know how that goes. Um, I'm a glutton for stuff. and I've, it, they, It's a donation place. Uh, the transfer station is uh, about a mile away, if even that, maybe a half a mile away. And uh, a lot of dona donated items are, are at the transfer station. And those items that work, uh, they bring them up and put them in here. And then, of course, people from all over the area bring in stuff and I brought in many items in the past around here and uh, and donated things that I didn't want so it helps a good cause different uh, people run this sometimes it's, it's the animal welfare league sometimes it's the uh, boy scouts and every week there's somebody else uh, running it and uh, so that you never know who's going to be running it and what the prices are going to be some people that run it want an arm and a leg for the things and next week if you wait a week later, they'll have another organization running the place, and uh, you can get the stuff for almost nothing. I bought brand new doorknobs for a quarter a piece uh, that I put on my uh, on my bathroom doors here at the house. Okay, this is the corridor. We're going back now, and I guess um, that's about it. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the little trip. It's just too bad I didn't find any good things. So you have yourself a good day, and thank you for watching this video.